welcome back to my country craft corner how in the world are you guys doing today it is so good to see you again and thank you so so much for stopping back by to see what i'm up to and what i'm up to today is my grandmother's hutch my grandmother's hutch which is right here sitting here beside me whoops sorry there we go and i'm going to be decorating the top of it today and I don't know whether you can see that spray that I have going around one corner of it. That is actually a lantern topper that I made last year for a big lantern that I have. And what I'm gonna sit here and do first before I get up on top there is I'm gonna make up, excuse my hair, y'all. It is a dank, yucky day out as you can see outside. It's getting late in the day though. Well, it's actually only 2.30, so it's been raining and yucky all day long. Uh, but anyway, what I wanna do before I get up there is I wanna make a flower arrangement that will mimic what I have going on in that bow. It's a bow swag. It was a bow swag that I had on. It's a funky bow with a, you know, with a swag out uh, out other side of it, which I'll, and I'll show you closer up when we get there. Uh, before I go any further, I want to tell you this will be my last Decorate With Me video in my Christmas series. Next up will be my home tour, y'all. And no, I haven't shown you my decorating outside. I haven't, I haven't done my decorating outside at this point. But I'm not going to show you a Decorate With Me out there. I want to have a little bit of a surprise for you guys. I always take you all the way through my, you know, my my series and I have had a couple of you say, I've not been watching your, your, you know, I couldn't stand it, I came to watch, but I've been trying not to watch them all because I want to be surprised, you know. So that kind of gave me the idea, well, shoot, I should give you guys some surprises. So that whole room, both of my Christmas trees probably, and my outdoor decor will all be surprises for you guys during my home tour. And it will be a pretty long and intense, you know, home tour. Probably it will be me walking through with all the lights on and telling you about every little thing. And then walking you out front and tell, or I'll probably start at my mailbox and work my way up the driveway and come in and then go in through the whole house. And then I'll turn all the lights out and I'll do it just to music, you know, with just the twinkly lights of Christmas. So that's the way I've always done it in the past and that's the way I'll do it then and I'll give you a minute mark of, if you don't want to hear me yammering along, you know, in the video that you'll be able to go right to minute mark, whatever, and that will just be the, the home tour set to music. So that's my plan moving forward, you know. I have been working really hard, pretty much I hit the ground running when I got back from my cruise. I need time to do my Christmas uh shopping and I need to do some cooking which of course I don't know I wanted to ask you too do you all want to see me do my fudge again I mean I've done it for two years I think I you know my peanut butter fudge recipes are online already on my YouTube channel I'm not sure that you want to see me do them again but I'm making the same things you know for Christmas Eve as I do every year so let me know if you want to see my cooking videos too, even though they are going to be the same, you know? <laughs> so, but anyway, let's get started. This. I just want to kind of give you an, I know, a little overview of what's coming up in the future for you guys, you know, and uh, through, through the month of December here <laughs> as we are already in and so close to Christmas. Oh my goodness, you guys, I can't even believe it. I can't even believe we're that close to Christmas already. So... Anyway, let me turn my camera here and I'm gonna get you pointed down and in a way where you can watch me do a little bit of work here. There we go. I'm gonna use this little pink pitcher. I got this on sale at, uh, where'd I get it? Hobby Lobby for $6.99. There you go, you can see $6.99 back in the spring. And I'm going to be adding a bit of blush pink into that bow topper up there and into this decor too. I'm not going to make anything over the top hard. I'm really just going to use a few picks here uh, or just bunches of flowers. Uh, these are the kind of flowers I had in that arrangement too. And literally, I'm just going to pretty much do that really and truly. Oh, 
I'm the girl that says more is more, aren't I? I'll go through these couple of things I have sitting here too. And I have one pink poinsettia. Look at this. And I need to cut it down a smidge. I know we're really close. Um, I can't get you back too, back too much further. couple of these that I thought I might add in two. And two more. I have these two and then I have two more for the spray. That's all they had. I got these at Joann's and that's all they had. So there we go. That'll do it. And it's just gonna go right up on the top of this hutch and just be an accent piece. And then I have a little bit of this if I wanna cut it apart and put some on the inside. I don't have a lot of pink though. Ugh. Oh my goodness. I've got more glitter than Carter has pills here. Ah! So that is one thing we'll put up there. We're gonna add those in in a minute. I thought I would tie a little bow, just a, a regular bow right around the body of this uh, base. And all I wanna do, I can't get my camera down low enough, you guys. I'll just show you after. I'm just gonna make a regular bow. Be right back. Okie dokie. Now, oof. let me show you, there's a bow there. Okie dokie. The other things that I wanna to try to fit up there are, I have this little Santa Claus <laughs> in his gold slacks there, carrying a tree and has a little squirrel on his arm there, a little woodland, has a little raccoon, <laughs> so cute. I got him at uh, Hobby Lobby last year for $30, 50, you know, of course, $15, 50% off. And then I got these two pretty little deer at Williamsburg last year, but I have seen them in a like and or not in that I've seen them in Tuesday morning and I've seen them in big lots I saw them in big lots so this year so I don't know whether your you know your store still has them but you could check and see if you like them and they do their little you know necklace wreath kind of lights up and so I've got two of them and they're kind of looking different different ways you know and then this fella <laughs> He is kind of a uh, coastal Santa Claus. And, you know, now I don't have coastal in here, but isn't he cute, you know? And look at his bag. He's just got shells in his bag there, you know? And he's carrying a shell, but that's okay. I like the color of his, his coat, and I like his gold jacket, and I think he's spiffy. He is one spiffy little Santa Claus or Father Christmas, right? So, then of course I have a couple of florals here too that I'm going to put up on the uh, Funky Bow Swag. And so let me get my camera situated and we'll do that first and then we'll, I'll get up on a ladder and we'll do the top 
of this hutch, my grandmother's hutch, and I'll show you what I did on the inside too. So, and I might add, wanna add a few things on the inside. So. Swag. Okay, here's the swag that I made, and it's, I'm gonna cut, these are the, the tails that I tied it on the lantern with, and I'm gonna cut these tails down just a smidge, just a little bit to bring them up, you know, about to here. And as you can see, this is the same. Here's a big funky bell. I believe it was 20 loops, but don't quote me. It might be less than that. I'm not sure. I can give you a link to where I made this. You can see it has a star here and a star here and bells and, you know, it was really pretty. And I put it on a big cream colored lantern and I filled the lantern with ornaments and put fairy lights through the ornaments. It was really pretty. But I decided I wanted to use it over here this year because I've been, this is kind of my blush pink corner, you know, uh, designed, you know, by my mom's blush, little doll here with blush on her, a blush color dress on her. So I do have two more of these picks left and I thought I would just simply just add one here no big deal just to add a little something something of the pink and then one down here uh oh yep these were not the most expensive jobbies there we go i'm going to cut up these tails a little bit let me see how I'm going to set you up to get you to the top because I need to get up with this ladder that I have the... <laughs> hmm. Okay, we're gonna see how this will work. <laughs> okay, let's start out with this flower arrangement that I want on this side. have a candle already in like a blush pink and then let's go with mr. Santa Claus here I can't decide whether I want him I've got a bunch of blocks up here hang on a second I'm gonna put him up here and then I'm gonna go get those deer we're gonna play around with it and see what I want where. Hang on a second. I think I might like him. Because he's about the same height as the, I want him over here. Okay, then I have my little Santa Claus. I have another candle here. And I've got a candle here. I'll put out here.
I need to get a cloth to put over this because I can see the wood from down here. But other than that, I'm liking this. I think that looks pretty. Kind of just like that. Okay, guys, I've got a, a doily. One of my grandma's old crocheted doilies. And I just really want to just hide the wood. I don't need it to be perfectly, wonderfully beautiful. Okay, and then I have my grandmother's um, decanter over here filled with pink water. And that kind of pulls the pink in too. And that'll do it, you guys. Let me get down off this ladder. Yep, I think that looks pretty. really want to do that because I think it'll take away from that I could do it over here but I don't want to I like it just like that and I'm not gonna put any lights over here so to speak I've got enough other lights goodness knows so let me get you down here and I'll show you the inside let me open this up and I'll show you I didn't really do a ton in here I just added a gold Christmas tree up there on the top shelf just a gold tree and then I added a little blushy pink uh, blingy poinsettia there and there and I left those flowers there that's what I want I want that up now that is where I did think I could take a couple of these little gold leaves here cut this apart and just add ranges out here and I'm just gonna leave the ivy in there it's okay I want to be able to find all my stuff again and I've got everything downstairs already so I'm just gonna leave this as is and kind of just you know there we go That's it. Now the Christmassy stuff in here that I've added, as I said, the Christmas trees, I added this little house and it is not, it is battery operated. Look at that. I hadn't even done anything with this last year. <laughs> I think I bought that at the end of the season or I got it in one of those $4 boxes or something from Michael's. I've got a little snowman trio or mommy and daddy and two kids, which is apropos. And uh, just my angels are still in here. And I've left these lovely little crystal pieces that Lisa got for me. I think they're so pretty. One of which is this beautiful angel. So, and I think that'll do it, you guys. I think that'll pull it all together. Just subtle and added to the decor that's already in there. I think it looks really pretty. Oh my goodness. All right, so let's go into some final words here and uh, that'll do it for this one. I'll take the camera down and you know, take you like I always do to music through everything and let you see everything, you know? I'm super happy with how this worked out. Very subtle, uh, not in your face gold. It's more of a champagne-y, you know, kind of a gold. So I'm so sorry about my hair, you guys. I get it cut and colored very soon and it is just, it gets to this point and I'm just like ready to go crazy, you know? <laughs> but anyway, uh, as I was saying, it's not like in your face gold. It's more of a subtle champagne, kind of a classic, uh, you know, just really soft, pretty, 
nod to my mom again with her little doll in her blush pink. So super happy with it. Alrighty. <laughs> so next time you see me in person here will probably be uh, for my home tour. Unless I do a car chit chat or something just to, you know, just to chat with you guys for a little bit. But, you know, other than that, it'll be my, my home tour next, whenever that will be. And I'll, if I've gotten a date pinned down by the time I edit this, I'll flash it up here right now and let you know uh, when it will be. And uh, then we'll go from there after that. So, oh my goodness, again, thank you guys so much for stopping in here to visit with me, to come along with me as I kind of bumble through my, my decor here. And thank you for all of your comments, all of your sweet, 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 sweet and funny and all encompassing comments. You guys are fantastic. I just love reading through your comments. And I know I have not been able to get back many 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 times throughout this series of videos and i apologize but you know the more subbies i get the more comments i get the harder it gets it doesn't mean i don't love you that doesn't mean i don't read every single word because i do every single word and it sure doesn't mean i don't love you because i sure do love you every single one of you i feel like we're a big family here so with all that said i'll just say that i hope that those of you who are struggling or suffering with a catastrophic illness or chronic pain, I hope you have someone there with you, taking care of you, helping you get through each day, making the very, very best out of each day. I hope there's nothing weighing on your minds or your hearts, pulling your attention away from where you want it to be or from where it should be. I love y'all to bits to bits to bits, hugs all around, and I keep you in my thoughts and my prayers every single day. With all that said, I'll just say, until next time, y'all take good, good care. Bye-bye. Come back for one last video, but bye-bye while I'm looking at you. <laughs>